Okay, guys, look what I found. This is the old price. They forgot to take off, probably. And this is the new price. Right? Because um, this is for these uh, cans. There was $2.99. The price corned beef hash. This, that's what it is. The price was put up on this uh, November 29, 2021. It was $2.99. And it's for the same thing. One beef hash, 12 ounce. Oh, that was 15 ounce. I think they shrunk the can. But this is like the same name and everything. Um, $5.99. For less ounces, $5.99. And the price was put up the March uh, 5th, just a few days ago. Look at that. Price double. Okay, guys, so prices are going up. But some of the prices are still the same that we... So we had seen for a while, for like a year now maybe. Um, some places still have things because they got them maybe uh, a while ago. They didn't uh, raise the price on them yet. So some of the prices are still cheap, but I'm stocking up now even more because I think um, they're going to go up um, a lot. So while they're still cheap, go and get whatever you normally use. If you normally use rice, get the rice. If you normally use flour and sugar, even if the, now you can buy bread and um, other baked goods, and that's why maybe you don't use a lot of flour and sugar. But if for some reason you can't go to the store and buy bread and uh, other baked goods like cookies or whatever, whatever you normally buy, uh, then you're going to be using way more uh, flour and sugar and probably oil and whatever else goes in the recipe. And if for some reason nothing changes and everything will be good, we can have food for a while. And if the food spoils, we can feed it to the chickens. Like if the rice gets bugs in it or something, we can feed it to the chickens and have some fresh eggs. So, Or goats can eat it too if, if it's not too spoiled the goats can eat it too so yeah just stock up just in case and because there's more chances that the food will still be good food and not spoil in your house then the dollar your dollar whatever you have can buy you um i don't know a few months from now so i'm gonna show you what i bought and i'm gonna show you some empty shelves in the store they're doing a good job fronting it so you can't really see until you get really close to that shelf and in that aisle because they're fronting you know, it looks good from far away so yeah and it's as, as usual pasta pet food and i didn't check the oil but um yeah it's the same things gone in every store also because of that war going in the um europe with russia and ukraine uh you know, Russia and Ukraine are, are growing lots of grains like um, uh, wheat and corn. And because we're not going to be getting them anymore, or I don't know if U.S. Ex gets the corn and um, uh, wheat from them. Maybe not. But even if we don't, there's going to be shortage in the world market, you know. And um, the world is going to end up having less of those grains, so the price will go up for everybody. So, and if grains will go up, um, the animal feed will go up, and the ra cost of raising meat will go up. And, you know, from animals we get meat, eggs, uh, milk products, all those things will go up too. So I'm so happy I have chickens and goats, because this way I have, I'm going to have... Um, eggs and uh, milk and if uh, my chickens get old I can always make meat out of them so but uh, you know I have another problem because I have those animals I have to stock up on food for them that's also uh, another thing to consider because if I run out I don't want them to starve me you know so just um, watch whatever I filmed in the store the, some of the empty shelves here and there I was kind of in a hurry so I, I filmed only a few things and the stuff I bought okay 
Thanks for watching, guys. Stock up on anything you can, especially if it still has old price or whatever it was uh, six, nine months ago, whatever is the still, still same price, stock up on it. Because some of the prices went up recently in the last um, two weeks or so. Hey guys, um, today I shopped at Smart and Final and I'm bringing you another haul. Uh, I'm stocking up and I bought some rice, two bags up to 50 pounds each. They're $18.99 still, the price hasn't changed since like a long time. So, but I think it's gonna go up, so that's why I got two. And sugar, I got 25 pounds. Uh, I forgot how much it was, probably like 15 something, which is still, which is kind of expensive from what I had before. And I got some wrenches, two of them, $2.99 each, big bottles. These cans, I think it's a good deal. We had similar ones before, they were a different brand, but they're like sardines and tomato sauce, which were good. They were only $1.79, they were on sale. And I got peas, 10 pound bags peas. They're still $4.49, which is still good because that price hasn't changed for um, at least uh, almost a year now, probably. And I bought some apples, 99 cents a pound, some avocados, $4.99 for like four avocados. <laughs> Expensive. And uh, some more peas in there. So I got four. Um, Four peas and um, some rice, 100 pounds of rice to stock up, and sugar.
This is I got for this morning. This is a quart jar and this is a half a gallon. So um, that's just for the morning. I didn't fit in the uh, in here. Babies are just chilling, waiting for their mamas to come back.